Well, February is Heart Health Month, and this morning we're learning about how access to advanced heart health care is about to expand in our area. News 13's Taylor Maresca spoke with the medical director of Thailand's Rehabilitation Center about heart health and what a new hospital in our area will mean to people who need advanced heart care. Good morning, Taylor. Good morning, Melissa. Tideland's Health is gearing up for a big expansion, and advanced comprehensive heart care is the focus. Heart disease is the number one killer of both men and women in the United States, and about half a million Americans undergo open heart surgery every year. Enter Tideland's Health Carolina Bay's Hospital. It'll be in the Saucesty community at the interchange of Highway 31 and 707. Its focus, advanced heart care. It will have things you can't find anywhere else in our area. To have that care here instead of having to go down to MUSC, which for some people just can't be done in that sense. So it, to have access right in our backyard is, is fantastic to have when that gets built. The new hospital will have an open heart surgery program and a cardiac catheterization lab. It'll also be fully staffed with cardiologists and cardiovascular surgeons. <laughs> Dr. James Huber specializes in rehab medicine. He sees patients as they recover from heart attacks or cardiac arrests. He says having this care close to home is a huge bonus for people who live here. And he says taking care of your heart health should always be a priority. It's something that you can never start too late, but you also have to be realistic with what you already have. The recommendations really haven't changed much. Do 30 minutes of moderate exercise several times a week. That hasn't changed in years. You know, eat right hasn't changed in years. The hospital already has state approval and pending legal appeals. Ground should break soon with a projected opening of 2027. Recruitment of these new heart health specialists has already begun, and in addition to the advanced heart care, the hospital will have 36 surgical beds and four operating rooms. In the newsroom, Taylor Maresca, News 13.